I have a delicious talk back for you tonight. We're joined this evening by Jeff Nelson. And we're talking about ice cream and ice cream scoopers. We have the Old West End Ice Cream Social coming up this Saturday. It's going to be 2410 Robin Wood from 2 until 6 o'clock. Yep. What, uh, what was the reason behind this? And give people a little hint at home. It has to do with ice cream scoopers. Well, uh, two years ago, I bought a postcard from a guy on eBay. And when he uh, learned my mailing address, he was, got all excited. And he said, I lived one block from where the zero ice cream scoop was invented. Uh, and I had to ask him what the zero ice cream scoop was. And he said, it's the most famous ice cream scoop in the world. And, uh, and apparently it was invented in a garage uh, one block from my house. And it continues to be the best selling ice cream scoop in the world. And it's very simple. I mean, there's not much to this. I it's, mean, it's very basic, but it's functional. It's just is. And, yeah, nobody's ever been able to Im improve upon it. Uh, there's plenty of knockoffs, but nobody's been able to improve upon it in 75 years. So I just thought it would be really cool to celebrate the 75th anniversary in 2010. So here we are, and we're, preparations are well underway. And this is the 75th anniversary of yeah. the scoop. Yeah. So you're doing kind of injunction with, in conjunction with that. Yeah. Oh yeah. Exactly. We're, we're celebrating the anniversary, and the ice cream scoop company who are in Florida now they're coming up, and uh, they're going to help scoop ice cream, and uh, they're giving away lots of scoops and all sorts of. It's going to be a lot of fun. Now, and then you were, you're going to, got a little demonstration for us with an ice cube here. I do. Apparently, this is going to melt an ice cube almost faster than I can do in my hand. Yeah. Tell me why that is. Go ahead and grab one of those ice this, cubes. This is because the, and you have to hold it, you know, in there. Okay. But because the, it, the thing is so well designed, it's cast out of aluminum, and then it's got a liquid inside, which also transmits the heat. So it just turns into a puddle of water. Yeah, and it's tough up to see it right there on the camera, but already I have a puddle. It's in, in my hand, and it, you know we're in a cool studio right here. Yeah, it's it's amazing, and w the more I learned about the invention and, and the inventor, Sherman Kelly, I'm just the more impressed I am because it's so simple. It's it's very, um, it, it's it's you you forget how much went into it. I mean, yeah. it was they inducted one into the uh, Museum of Modern Art in 1956 as a beautiful an example of beautiful. You want to put that in here? Yeah, well, actually, why don't, I, why don't I take, I'll take the ice cube off here. Just in the minute we were here, I'll just show people already. We've just got a pretty decent sized puddle. So it's, it's an amazing little it piece of technology that doesn't look at it. And we also have some displays of here of some of the things they tried originally yeah, to do, but didn't work out so well. It was really cool. All, as, as you probably know, all ice cream scoops before this had all, con, all kinds of different mechanisms that, with levers and, that would um, kick the ice cream out once you scooped it. And he came upon the idea that there's got to be an easier way. So first he tried electrifying the scoop, but apparently it would get too hot to hold on to. <laughs> these are original prototypes. Yeah, the Sherman 30s. Kelly was the one that had started these. Yeah, started this. And then this is an early one that's made out of copper. He hit upon the idea of having it be hollow. And uh, but basically, since 1935, it's been exactly the same shape, pretty much unchanged. As it, from today. And all right, and, and, and so this, you can get it, catch it all Saturday, the September 11th. The rain day, by the way, is Sunday, if there is an issue out there from 2 until 6 at yeah. 2410. Robin, we thank you very much for thank your time. You. Appreciate it. See you Saturday, and that is your talk back.